Hi everyone this is Shivani here welcome to my channel Shivani Creations today i am going to show you how to make this very beautiful quilt mother and child wall hanging isn't it very beautiful so i will show you how to make this mom and kid painting and also all the quilting flowers leaves and other decoration so let's start with procedure for this we need some multicolor 3 mm quilling strips half cut pearls quilling comb liquid glue quilling tool scissor white orange red and brown poster colors four number round brush one black permanent marker 200 gsm thick white cardstock and one pattern paper i have printed this sketch on thick white cardstock this is a a4 size cardstock and you can download the sketch from the description box so here i am starting with coloring the face using poster colors i have mixed orange and white color to create this light tint color so first fill all the body parts so it's done now i am taking little darker shade and i will do some shading work i'm just giving some small strokes to highlight the features now spread this dark color just by using simple water so it's done now i will start coloring the baby i am taking little darker shade for the baby i have mixed little yellow in this flesh tint color now i have mixed some brown color to this and giving some highlights to the features so it's done let it dry now i am coloring the hairs using brown color in the similar way i have colored the baby's hairs so it's done now i am coloring the lips and the eyes So painting is done. Now let it completely dry. Now I will show you how to make this Malaysian flower. For this I am taking one strip of blue color and I have added half strip of yellow color with this. So first make a loose coil like this. Add glue and just pinch it. Now take your quilling tool and just twist this petal like this. 
and wrap this whole petal using yellow color strip secure the end so petal is ready in the similar way i have created those flowers using some different color combinations and for each flower i have added seven petals and at the center i have added half cut balls now i will show you how to make these flower petals for this i am taking my comb and inserting one purple strip from the center by leaving two lines and now i am just folding it and securing it by glue now just increase the level from top and bottom each time you rotate the strip till the end i have attached to one yellow strip to this so i'm just adhering it with glue and rotating one more time and adding glue on other side also now take out this pattern from the comb and twist this whole petal like we did with malaysian flower petal now wrap the remaining yellow strip around this petal so petal is ready in the similar way i have added two layers of the same petal using yellow and blue combination and for this flower i have created outer layer with the same color combinations and for the inner layer i have just created the malaysian flower and added yellow pollens now i will show you how to make this petal so first create this outer layer like we did this and for the inner part i am using half strip of light blue color make a teardrop shape like this add glue inside this petal and connect the teardrop with this so the petal is ready in the same way i have created these petals and for the inner layer i have used half strip of purple and created leaf shape and added blue pollens inside this so these flowers are done hope you got the idea now i will show you how to make this petal for this I am taking orange color strip and making five loops just by increasing the loop size each time. Like this. Now cut excess strip. Secure the end. So loop is ready. In the same way, I have created two more loops using yellow color. Now I will connect all three loops to construct the leaf. Like this. Wrap this whole petal by using yellow color strip. So the petal is ready. in the same way i have created these petals using pink and purple combination and added one pink tight coil using two strip and one half cut pearl and this petal is also similar to this just i have used all three loops using same red color and wrapped with yellow color strip and added white tear drops inside this with one half cut pearl so these flowers are also done now i will show you the last flower for this i am taking half strip of yellow color and making one leaf shape in the same way i created two more leaves using red color so i am connecting all three petals and now wrap this whole petal using red color strip secure the end 
so petal is ready so using this petal i have created this flower by adding total seven petals and added red color pollens in the center so this is done and for this flower i have just added two different shades of greens and this is just a basic shape this is a leaf shape and added one red tight coil in the center i have also created some scrolls leaves using sap green and dark green shades if you want to learn these basic leaf shapes and scrolls i have given link in description box you can check there now i will show you how to make this beautiful leaf so i am taking my comb again inserting one sap green from second slot from the top now take out your strip from first slot from the bottom like this and take down like this now again take out the strip from the same slot where you have started and take down by leaving two gaps again take it up and take it down so repeat this process till the desired size so it's done now i'm adding glue on back side and connecting this strip the texture strip and take out this whole pattern from the comb in the same way i have created one more pattern now i'll connect both of the pattern to construct the leaf shape like this now i am taking one fourth strip of dark green and making one loose coil then make a tear drop shape like this now open the loop add glue and insert this tear drop inside this in the same way i will insert dark green tear drops inside each loop like this. so it's done isn't it looking beautiful so these leaves i have created with different color combinations now i will show you this last leaf for this i am taking one strip of light green color and making one tight coil first add glue and pinch it from both the sides make little dome using your finger add glue in the similar way i have created six more petals now i am taking one piece of strip add glue on both the sides add one leaf in the center and wrap the strip around this like this now add remaining leaf like this so the leaf is ready so all the flowers leaves scrolls are done if you have any doubt you can ask in comment section now we will decorate our mother and kid drawing so before that i am cutting this drawing from the border using my scissor also i'm cutting the inner part using paper cutter
so it's done now I'm taking this pattern paper which measures 26 centimeter by 34 centimeter and I will attach this painting on top of this pattern paper if you don't find pattern paper easily you can also use any contrast color thick sheet for the background or you can use gift wrapping paper so just add glue on back side of this and connect on top of this let it dry for some time now I will assemble all the flowers by connecting with glue on top of this so it's up to you how you want to arrange the flowers So it's done. Now to make hairs I am using my comb again and inserting brown strip through this in the center and just increasing the level one by one from upper part and lower part. So this is the same process. secure then using glue take out this pattern from the comb and just pinch it using your fingers so hair is ready in a similar way I have created some more hairs using different shades of brown color now I'm taking back my painting and connecting the hairs So it's done now before adding other hairs I am connecting all the leaves and scroll with my painting
so it's done isn't it looking beautiful now i will add remaining hairs so just continue this process for the mom and for the kid So after adding hairs, it will look like this. I have added all the parts, and for the baby's hair, I have used some light brown shades of strips. So the mom and kid painting using quilling strips is done. My project is done for today. Hope you enjoyed my video. Please subscribe my channel for more interesting videos, and don't forget to click on bell icon for the latest updates. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.